Well, hello everyone. You, you talk about right here, talk about for disabilities and also talking about you know, any source of uh, technical failures and uh, understanding about the, you know, the technical notes in regards to failures. And uh, most of the time we probably think it is too, is toward it. Yeah, well, uh, you know, what I was also thinking about is toward it. You know, if you were to be uh, looking at any letters or notes or anything like that uh, based on uh, you know, disability papers, and what I mean by is this toward, yeah, letters that are written to you just to uh, allow, uh, you know, more extended time, or maybe, you know, something like, uh, you know, it could also be uh, related to about, you know, your ability to word it, uh, you know, yeah, you know, whenever you first uh, are starting to be trained, uh, even on a job, or, you know, anything, uh, that is uh, related to about, you know, uh, you know, yeah, training process. It could also even be uh, related to about, you know, making sure that, the, you know, any work that you're working on and making sure that you don't get overworked or you know, overly, you know, overly exhausted, you know, from all the work that you're doing in the first place. But, uh, you know, different ways of how you want to describe disability, right? But um, but then also when we speak about failures, though, uh, that it's it seems like to word that yeah that what's the what what's one of the most important reason that whenever it comes to understanding about failures and like yeah well really that uh, there's a difference between uh, knowing about you know the possible risk of a failure happening compared to preventing a failure from happening and I know a lot of a lot of mechanics and engineers would say too that uh, you know one of the reasons why that they would probably keep a lot of notes handy and maybe a lot of uh, documentation analysis and all that equipment and everything already is because you to prevent the failures from happening right and so i include right here of this uh, so far note of saying right here i talk about for disability you know, the ability to learn uh, at your own pace and please explain your disability i am disabled you know, due to the following reason and i have difficulties Reading and writing, and uh, what is uh, so special about that? So it sure seems that way that um, that if we're going to be starting any sort of conversation, right? And uh, it sure seems that way. Like people may say, is toward it. Yeah, well, really, that uh, whenever you do start working on something, especially, and it's like, yeah, you know, uh, people might see a number of things that you're good at, right? And let's just say that you know, number one. You know, if something was broken at the beginning, so let's just say that on average that, that whenever you uh, first start working on something that uh, somebody's going to maybe say that, you know, yeah, well, really, that, uh, you know, whenever you first uh, started working on something that that something was broken, right? You know, you probably thinking as to where that, yeah, well, really, that uh, whenever you first start working on something that uh, that something was broken, and uh, whenever you first start working on it, you know, just to be able to get that, you know, it could have been a small fix or something like that. And like I tell people too, it sure seems that way that uh, maybe you're able to get somebody's attention just by the fact about if it was a small fix that, uh, you know, maybe if the, the plugins, uh, you know, you maybe if you had to, yeah, you know, uh, undo something and maybe take something apart and put it back together and maybe you think that it could have been a small fix or something. But still, that it sure seems that way that, uh, that whenever you first start working on something, and let's just say that if you're able to uh, fix the problem, or maybe if you're able to get something to work a lot of times, and it usually that that, that goes by saying is toward it, yeah, well, really, that when, once you do uh, start getting something to work, you know, but uh, by half the time, you want to know, too, that uh, that whenever, uh, whenever you're trying to understand about uh, failures, though, and then also understanding about that... that um, that uh, whenever you're going to be putting together, yeah, you know, the the like the the documentation about understanding about what's going on with the the device and then uh you know what's going on with the equipment and all that, but but half the time you want to know too that um, you know why would you spend uh, up to maybe five hours a day working on something knowing like people may even say too is that yeah well really that. Uh, most of the time, whenever you are working on any source of equipment or appliances, a lot of times, it sure seems that way. That um, at the first thing that you're going to be thinking about is, is that uh, that you know why do you spend so much time working on it, knowing it if you could even fix it, and uh, you know what is it that you're able to accomplish by doing that? And so it sure seems that way. That uh, 
that the first thing that you think about, you know, like everybody else to say is toward a, yeah, well, you know, if you are a person with a disability and, uh, you know, knowing about, okay, if you are a person with di with a disability, then uh, you may think that, that, that you are limited to uh, what you can do and maybe with uh, how people, uh, yeah, you know, it's especially whenever it comes to uh, being recognized for something and also um, if it's also, you know, another you know, the higher domain, and, um, you know, you know, that's another word I want to mention right here, is like, you know, the higher domain. And I know I mentioned that, but yeah, the higher domain, well, well, what does that mean necessarily? That means is toward that, you know, some, uh, you know, that, um, that, that, you know, some, you know, someone, um, is, um, is asking um, you know, for um, your skills. Yeah, somebody's asking for your skills. They uh, know uh, you um, have um, good confidence with. So each time I think about this too, is that uh, you know talk about like a disability, your paper, but but still that uh, I was thinking too if I want to go ahead and maybe use a word document here just to show everybody about disability papers because a lot of times it's like yeah it's usually about three to four sentences long, something like that explaining about uh, what the disability is and if for any reason any concerns of the matter, but you know still it sure seems that way that. Uh, when we speak about disability, though, it sure seems that way to where are you really setting a limit to your ability for what you can do or for any reason that uh, what, you're, what uh, you're trying to tell this company or anybody that, that, that's needing the information is to where that, uh, you know, go easy on this person. You know, so it sure seems that way that uh, the letter should say something like, you know, go... Uh, Hey, go go easy on this person. So it sure seems that I'm like yeah, go go easy on on this person, and um, or I can just say go go easy, um, go easy on them. I'm like I I <laughs> yeah, go easy on them, you know, on uh, on the person. So it sure seems that way that uh, you know I could also. Uh, Put on here that um, something like um, you know on on the person and then um, that um, your work um, not uh, made easy. So it sure seems that way that uh, whenever you first start talking to somebody about something, and a lot of times it sure seems that way that. Uh, you know, you would uh, maybe want to highlight uh, words like that. I'm like, oh, yeah, I talk about for for work, you know, between easy and hard or something like that. <laughs> easy, um, easy, hard or something like that. So it sure seems that way that, uh, that each time we think about this right here, uh, talking about, you know, yeah, you know, I have difficulties, you know, uh, with, uh, I have difficulties reading and writing. That is, uh, you know, what is so special about that? So, so it sure seems that way, that uh, the way we think about the, a lot of these sentences right here, though, and it sure seems that way, that um, that whenever you first start a conversation with somebody, and let's just say that uh, whenever you first uh, start a conversation with somebody, that uh, the first thing comes first, right, is to where that, uh, you know, there was a, the question was in regard to a technical, you know, difficulty of a matter. And let's just say that maybe the reason why that you were, you know, connecting to a tech supporter was because mm -hmm. of, of the fact that, you know, maybe if your smartphone wasn't working properly or something that uh, had to do with a malfunctioning situa device of the situation or something like that. And uh, that's why it sure seems that way that, um, that whenever... You do start a conversation a lot of times. It sure seems that way to where they, yeah, well, really, that uh, 
you know, what you really are trying to put together right here on this note right here about disability is toward it, uh, you know, name one thing special about what is it that you do, and at least if you're able to get it to work, and then chances are that then this company will, you know, they'll, they'll ask you to go ahead and do a, a favor again at a later on time too, so it sure seems that way. That, that whenever you're building skills, right, it seems like a, a lot of times you say if you're building skills, but a lot of times it sure seems that way that uh, whenever we talk about, uh, you know, I am disability, you know, for the following reasons, and uh, so it sure seems that way that uh, whenever we speak about disability, what is uh, so special about that, you know, for higher demand, so I can go ahead, I'm like, yeah, I mean, I can go ahead and start a new sentence like down here, but uh, still, I can just say is, is that in case of anybody were to say that, you know, how would you really answer that right there? I'm um, like, well, really, it, um, you know, what is so special about that? I'm like, well, that, you know, that, uh, the person, um, the personnel will, uh, tell, um, you, uh, that, um, that you know that you know you uh, you uh, are uh, you know the the only hope um, that the only hope um, we um, know um, that we have when um, it um, comes um, time. To um, to complete yeah the completing task um, completing a large uh, task and it could also be you know, multitasking go ahead and maybe put your know, comma for multitasking for multitasking and uh, also uh, you know for your uh, knowledge and uh, so it sure seems that way that um, that whenever you do write a letter and let's just say that if you're going to be talking about a disability right but a lot of times it sure seems that way that uh, you know the question uh, you know, do you do you think that maybe sometimes it could be turned around and like let's just say that people may say is toward the reason why I wrote this letter right here is to indicate about my disability, but still, it's like, you know, do you think for any reason at all that uh, people might say is toward it, really, that, uh, you know, you go ahead and start out a new sentence by saying, uh, you know, favors, yeah, you know, uh, favor is like, uh, you go ahead and put the, ask for a favor, So a lot of times it sure seems that way. Yeah, ask for a favor with a question mark. So, so a lot of times that how many uh, you know front you know how many customer service agents, if anything, are maybe gonna be you know talking you know like like that to where that uh, you know yeah that you know number one that um, that that there was once upon a time to where that uh, you know somebody who had a disability though and like one oh two that yeah well really. If you don't have a key, you know, or if you don't have authorization just to be able to have access to those files or, you know, anything else that you were trying to work on, trying to gather up. and But it sure seems that way that, um, that you know, why, uh, you know, like everybody else will want to know, too, that according to the disability paperwork, though, uh, that, uh, you know, do you think that maybe you can have what you call the special uh, attention and maybe the special assistance, you know, in both ways? <laughs> But I just really think, though, in a lot of ways, that whenever we cut, when we talk about disability, though, that uh, you may think that just because you have a disability means that you are restricted to uh, what you can do and your abilities for what you can learn and all that. But a lot of doctors would say, too, that no, that's not all true either. You, know, you are not restricted. You are not restricted uh, to your ability. You are not restricted to your ability. No, that that's not what it's about. And well, what it's about is that, uh, you know, if you're going to be working on something, that uh, this right here, you know, indicating about your disability, that's, uh, 
you know, people say is I say, yeah, you know, don't be so hard on the person and also to understand about is that if they need more time, then give them more, a little bit more time just to be able to get the work done, right? But, but in a lot of ways, it sure seems that way that when we do speak about disability, though, it's like, yeah, you know, special attention, you know, uh, the things that you have difficulty understanding whenever it comes to reading and writing and maybe remembering things or something like that. But like everybody else would maybe want to know too, that, that there's something about you for what you do that maybe that, that you can maybe give. Uh, like so, so yeah, something that you can give. And uh, so a lot of times, uh, how many of us will maybe want to know too, that how often do we really think about that? And talk about for the restrictions of you, but you're asking for favors to where they're talking about uh, that, uh, you know, whenever it comes to uh, give, you know, the special, um, you know, yeah, I can also cause this to where that the call, um, calling for the gift of kindness, you know, get the gift of kind. I can just you know, say that. So it sure seems that way that, um, Whenever we speak um, about um, disability, you know, talk about for the gift of kindness, uh, you know, they call call for the gift of kindness, right? But but whenever we do uh, start conversations about stuff, a lot of times it sure seems that way that um, that yeah, whenever you do um, you you know you start a conversation about something, right? It could also be technical issues and something like that. And uh, it sure seems that way that, uh, you know, you really uh, want to start the conversation by telling somebody that the reason for this letter right here is to explain to you about uh, my disability and, and uh, you know, what I can handle. Number one, you know, I can't handle all this work and, and I can't handle, you know, 10 objectives within the week's time. And I can't handle the fact about that, you know, after five hours of after working and then find out that there's more higher demands of the workflow and uh so it sure seems that way that um that it's like uh, yeah that um you may uh we may want to start out the objective by saying is toward that you know yeah 10 uh 10, 10 objectives or something like that <laughs> 10 objectives and then uh you know 10 um 10 tasks plus um, 5 hours. So it sure seems that way that uh, if we were to actually write that down into like an equation, though, and that you want to too, is to word it, do you believe that that's just a little bit too much for one person to handle, especially, you know, if they're going to be working on something? And, you know, you might think, number one, too, that if they're trying to learn the basic skills at their own time you know yeah at their own time they they learn privately and so like let's just say on average though that uh that you know at your own time which means is that you know, at your own at your own time what does that mean when we say at your own time well it means that not everything has been confirmed yet Yeah, confirmed. If you, you know, some some experts would also say that that you know authorized and um, some experts uh, would say you know something like authorized or approved. I'm like yeah, you know approved. And I know a lot a lot of experts would say that that you know approved is the right wording for it if we're talking about based on any source of research and based on any data that's collected uh, from the database, such as uh, maybe in the labs or something like that. But on the other hand, it sure seems that way that um, that when uh, we do uh, think about you know, disability, though, that, uh, you know, really, that um, the way this uh, note right here is written right here, and we probably think it is toward it, really, that... Um, that, you know, whenever I look at that a lot of times, it sure seems that way. Do you find it more of like a goal or do you kind of look at that more as to where it's a higher demand 
or you know yeah that uh you know if you were able to do at least maybe you know 10 percent i'm like yeah not, not 10 objectives but let's just say if you're able to work for four or maybe five objectives out of that whole agenda you know list that you had planned during the whole week and uh, you tell people too that uh you know, I believe that I've done more than what I originally said I was going to do. And so, like, let's just say if you want to go ahead and start a sentence by saying this to where I believe I did more. So, 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 so it, sure, it sure seems that way that um, when we first start working a task, though, a lot of times, and you want to know, too, that... Uh, you know, the bit, one of the problems whenever it comes to disability, though, and it sure seems that way, that, uh, you know, you really want to just take one thing at a time, right? But on the other hand, that, uh, like, uh, you know, a lot of these other, you know, like, yeah, if it's uh, experts and then professionals, and they might not even mean that, that they say it, you know, either, but let's just say on average that, uh, you know, whenever you first start working on something, that it seems like that you're kind of putting your mind on on overdrive. So I guess if you want to kind of call it like you know for over you know overtime or something you know overdrive or something like that you know overtime. So every time you do think about um, you know disability and your work in progress and everything, and you want to know too is toward how is it you think that maybe malfunctions could possibly happen. And, why do you think that maybe that they, if there's anything that could have gone a little bit better during the process and like earlier that there was updates that took place during you know, the installation or something like that. So, so yeah, a lot of times it sure, it sure seems that way that uh, understanding that the type of language is on, but but still, that, that you know, the analysis of the database and all that about what to, what sorts of failures that, that happened, right? But also about the disability right here. So let's just say... That if if we were to be writing a note, you know, just talking about is toward if you were to set like a goal, right? And with that goal, it would be advised as toward that I have a disability, so I ask you to please, you know, go easy on my time. That my time is very sensitive, and uh, I'll let you know uh, what I come up with, but still, that, uh, it's like, I don't really know if it's really about, you know, being carried away or, you know, like everybody else, like all the other professionals and experts would say, too. Is it, uh, you know, really that I know I, I'm, I'm sorry, but we, we apologize. But um, but to let you know that we're working a little bit behind on schedule. And so a lot of times that that's usually what some experts would more like to say, too, that, uh, you know, if, if you're going to be getting behind on schedule, you know, yeah, behind, if you get behind on schedule, if one of you do get behind on schedule due to any delays and all that, and then for sure, for any delays and postponements or anything like that, and that, that is why it sure seems that way, that after you complete one task, and it seems like it multiplies, and you will I want to know too, that, uh, you know, the only time... Uh, yeah, seems like I had that almost all the time. Really, I'm like, well, what? Uh, well, what? Why? Why do you think? Uh, I, you know, it seems like to me that maybe that should be a question mark right there. You know, why do you think? Why should your work, you know, multiply? You know, when we, uh, whenever I, whenever I say multiply, I also mean by this to where that uh, you know, it's it's pretty much you know, yeah, it's a. Uh, it's not the same thing as reset, but it's um another word I'm saying is to my key. I'm talking about multiplies is to word that uh, that um more um more specific. I'll just I'm like yeah. I know I'm running out of space here on this note, but uh, more specific. So it sure seems I'm like yeah. More more specific. So it sure seems that way that you know, you may think that maybe one simple objective and maybe one simple answer would maybe explain a lot of things, but like everybody else would say too, that uh, it's just another reason to why that, that you know experts would say is to where that that's another reason why that we want you know thirty minutes more of your time, and like yeah, well. 
from the last conversation that we had about this, that uh, you said uh, something like, you know, yeah, so it sure seems that way. That, um, so every time we think about maybe three or four paragraphs of a sentence that uh, you tell people that, uh, okay, yeah, yeah, this is what I do know and this is what I don't know. And uh, so, you know, whenever you do start a conversation with anybody, really, and uh, you would like to know, too, as to what it, do you think that maybe you should uh, write on there, the things that you can handle and maybe the things that you cannot handle. But it's like you want to know, too, as to what it, uh, you know, really, that, uh when a we call special, though, that uh, it's another word of saying is to, it's another way of source of saying is toward it. Uh, you know, yeah, that uh, this uh, group, uh, this company is willing to uh, treat you uh, very special to where that the, they're going to go ahead and give you a gift of kindness or if anything that the, they're going to treat you fairly or if anything, they're going to go ahead and and uh, treat you with the, the special treatment, and uh, or something like that, uh, that they're going to be uh, you know, not so hard on you, and uh, they're going to go ahead and, and assist you with, uh, with something like that they normally don't do, uh, you know, to maybe a few other client, other you know, co-workers or anything like that, and uh, so it sure seems that way, that when we speak special, though, it's another way of saying this to where, that yeah, do you call that normal, or do you just kind of call that to where, that uh, no, it's um, it's not really normal, but it's really just like, you know, special pretty much means, you know, like as we all know, special means is that uh, it's a um, a treatment um, of um, the kind. It's a treatment of the kind. To where that somebody uh, gives you that special treatment of a kind whenever they do uh, know that uh, you know there's something about you that we need that we can't get it you know from and but you know like uh, anybody want to tell like, yeah there, there, there are different ways of how you want to describe it really but but I just really think too is to where that whenever we speak about special though that it's like yeah well really that uh, you know, that there's uh, something uh, about you that, of course, and uh, like, yeah, well, you know, not so difficult. And to me, though, that I just really think that that's really what it's about, is to where, yeah, not so difficult. Not so, and I can go ahead and maybe put, um, you know, how do you put that into an equation, really, if you just put in your dash or something like that right there, I'll just go ahead and just do that. You know, not so difficult. So, yeah, you know, um, so if I were to say, if I were to put like that right there, so if I were to go ahead and put the note like, just like that right there, not so difficult, treatment of a kind. So a lot of times you want to, to anybody who's going to be reading a note or a letter like that are going to maybe be thinking as to where that I'm not quite sure what is it that these statements are trying to, to, to show here. Well, well what's, what's the proof and what, what's the point? Well, on your hand, it's like, yeah, that, you know, you go ahead and put, like, maybe a parentheses and quotations right there. But, but on your hand, it's like, yeah, well, really, if you're writing a note, you know, about something, what is it that you really are trying to tell anybody, really? And uh, part of the reason is, like, say, yeah, about your disability. But whenever you first start working on something, it was broke, right? And you want to know, too, is to where that whenever you first start working on something... That the, it, it, you know, it, there was a point toward that that item that you were working with, you know, it was broken. Or if anything, it, all it needed was a new battery. You know, you just had to replace the battery or it needed a, a fuse or it just had to have tentacle wiring repairing or something like that. And so that's another reason why everybody else might even say too that, uh, you know, the only reason maybe why a client would jump on board the conversation just by saying is to where, yeah, well, if you're able to get the problem fixed, you know, okay, well, if you're able to get something to work on, and then for sure they're going to go ahead and start the conversation with you, and hey, you know, well, how did, how did you do that? <laughs> so a lot of times it's like, yeah, that um, anything about technical support, you know, 
technical support, you know, the stuff that uh, the stuff that maybe that they'll you know want to record at some point. And like say is to where, you know, how did you do that? So I'm like, yeah. So it, like it's another way of how you want to cause is to where, you know, this is where the magic begins. You know, for how how does the magic begin? Well, number one, that you know, whenever you see things working, you know, and a lot of times it sure seems that way that that's usually the case, right? But uh, on your hand, it's like um, when we speak about disability, though, it's like you know your ability to learn at your own pace, right? You, know, you uh, yeah, I can go and put on here private. You know, you um. So if we were to sp say something like, yeah, you know, talk about for private right here, and and um, so if you were to write a, uh, a note like that right there, and, let, and let's just say if you were to save it and maybe come back to it later on and maybe export it, you know, maybe into a different program, and for sure that, uh, you, know, uh, you know, not everybody's really going to understand what you were referring to, and let's just say you were using... One note to do this, but let's just say if you open this up in like a you know yeah if you were to convert this uh, to like a maybe a PDF document or something like that, you know I don't really recommend that really anybody doing that. But whenever you do do that, then uh, you know the more likely people are say well really that uh, whenever you're whenever you are taking down notes, what you really should be doing is toward it you're keeping a notes on you know for reference to where you know, you should maybe you should not be thinking about to where the opening these uh these notes up into a different into another program and maybe seeing if you can go ahead and do any editing from there but like anybody say that you know yeah well that's not really yet what you should be doing you know like but the, you know, with these notes right here that you know, whenever you write things down what you really are doing is you're kind of like brainstorming ideas about the things that your thoughts and opinions on what you want to talk about, and then you're actually writing them down on a note, you know, right there, and, uh, you know, from your phone, right? But like everybody else might even say that, um, that uh, maybe if you felt comfortable enough to where that uh, if you just want to go ahead and just write down a few thoughts and ideas for what comes to your mind, then let's just say that, uh, you know, maybe if it is, uh, maybe journal or something like that, but People might say if you if you write down at least maybe you know maybe a hundred and fifty words or something like that of something that you were talking about, and if you wanted to save it, if you want to save your work and come back to it later on, but it's like everybody else might even say too that um, that whenever you, when we speak about notes though that uh, you know you may thought as toward yeah sticky notes, the sticky note that uh, on average though that uh, those sticky notes. You were only able to fit about, you know, how many words on just one little uh, sticky note. You know, even if it is uh, maybe a sticky note or a super sticky note or something like that. I'm like, I'm, I'm thinking, you know, if you're able to, if you're lucky to maybe to uh, write at least maybe 25 or maybe 40 words of a sentence onto a sticky note. And, uh, but still, but it sure seems that way that uh, whenever you first start a sticky note a lot of times, you're probably thinking is toward, okay, uh, you know, um, that uh, talking about technical failures and that whenever you first start working on something and, you know, you go ahead and write down a few notes and like, you know, yeah, I've checked everything and everything seems to be working good now. And, uh, you know, so, yeah, so let's just say that uh, if you were using it, maybe to coordinate with our clients and all that, but let's just say if you were to write down on a, a sticky note, you know, saying is toward, yeah, well, if you didn't get my uh, email message from earlier, you know, I think, uh, you know, according to uh, my application status and according to um, what I mentioned, you know, during the meeting was, is that, that, you know, due to my disability that I can only handle, you know, three uh, objectives at a time, you know, not ten of them. And uh, so it sure seems that way that every time... We do think about work in progress, though, in uh, 102 is toward it. Uh, you want to go ahead and write uh, a form, uh, even, you know, even a letter, you know, even uh, written by your doctor, and probably thinking, too, is toward that you can really only handle so much. 
So really, what is the main point about whenever you do think about your disability, whenever you do think about all the tasks, the task and all the objectives and everything that you got you know, coming on your schedule? And uh, to me, though, I just really think it should be about progress, right? But everybody else might look at that as to where that, uh, you know, really that... Um, the chances of there being a failure is maybe going to be up to uh, maybe the, the the scale of that. You could be maybe lower than likely or maybe a little bit higher than likely just because of the fact about, you know, for how much work that you put into something. But let's just say that if it's a little bit more than what you can handle, then for sure. Then, then you like you go go easy on, on, the, on the progress. And uh, so it's like... Um, so it sure seems that way that each time we think about that disability, though, in the like 102, is that, you know, yeah, you know, uh, the, the exam, you know, please explain your disability. So it's like uh, that every time, almost every time I think about that, it's like, you know, really, you should not be thinking about a disability as another reason to why, you know, uh, the company that doesn't like you, somebody that doesn't like you just because of that reason, you know, that's... That, that's just not, not true, and uh, so that's why everybody else would say, too, is to where to please think about that, is to where that, that, you know, this company, they're one to learn a little bit more about you, about what you do, and so, you know, in order to be able to learn more, learn more about what you do, about, um, about you, though, and, you know, in order to be able to learn more about you, it seems like to word it, yeah, that there's going to be objectives and that there's going to be, uh, you know, like, yeah, like everybody else may even say, too, that, um, that you know, uh, well, why, uh, whenever you, when we think about a disability a lot of times, that, that the first thing is first, is to where you really want to think about the things that you like, you know, the, th the things that you like. The things that you like and the, the things that maybe people might, like, yeah, like everybody else would say too, that, uh, you know, rules and guidelines and everything. The rules and guidelines. And uh, so every time I think about this, and I, I can be honest with everybody here too, every time I think about this, I also keep thinking too, is that... Um, if you were to write the letter yourself, and people might even say, too, you wrote this yourself, that's called cheating. Because maybe you should be uh, having it to where it has to be approved, uh, maybe by the manager, or it has to be confirmed and maybe authorized by the manager, or maybe the, the, the president, you know, the co-owner of the company first, before it's actually uh, confirmed. And so that's why it sure seems that way. That uh, whenever it comes to understanding about letters and notes and all that, and everybody else might even say too, is to where that uh, whenever we do it, think about, you know, writing down notes and maybe typing letters or anything like that. And uh, you're probably thinking is to where that, um, that if you were to be uh, spending time, at least 40 minutes of your time to go ahead and write down an objective or maybe a note or like maybe anything about goals and achievements and all that. And I want to know too is to where do you first start out the sentence by saying is to where that you know talk about my disability, right? My disabilities is to where I have difficulties reading and writing, but on the other hand too, the special treatment is talk about the treatment of kind and not so difficult about that. So really though, it's like you know, whenever you do write a note about something, you would include a question mark, right? And for that reason, why you would include a qu a question mark like I, like I mentioned before you know what what is the reason why you would include a question mark and I could even include like a little smiley face right there but still what is the reason why you would include a question mark you know from there and if, the, if for any reason at all I guess they probably say is to well really the reason why you would maybe do that put a question mark right there is that the knowing about Somebody else that could be reading that, and that for who uh, that could be reading that would maybe say is to where they, do you have the same thoughts and opinions about that, or do you think anything else that uh, that you think that you would like to say about that? And I want to know too that yeah, well number one, 
that whenever you think about disability though right here but on this letter right here that you indicated is toward that uh, this system on windows you know when it was updated installed automatically but then it flipped it you know it not could be flipped the switch and then the bug it you know the system it needs to refresh the battery so it sure seems that way that um that whenever you first uh, start working on something it was broke you know you know you probably thinking is toward that the whole that the entire situation started as to where that it was defective, it was broke. You know, you were not able to get anywhere just because of the fact about what was wrong, what you were able to find out during the time being. And so that's why it sure seems that way that, uh, you know, why do you think that you would maybe want to go from uh, the fact about, okay, you go ahead and write a letter down and maybe a few objectives and all that, and then uh, you go back to the note right here. And then this note right here says right here, you know, good to go for now. Your engagement has been restored. You just, uh, you just noticed, and you know, no connection and all. So a lot of times, it sure seems that way. It's kind of like like a back and forth, back and forth conversation, right? <laughs> but it sure seems that way. That, that you know, why do we think about that? You know, to the point to where um, that when we speak about failures and maybe disability, though, right? And you were no twos to where that. Um, that, you know, really, what is so magical about that? And a lot, you know, like anybody say that, well, really, professional engineers and mechanics would say, too, is that there's really no magical uh, explanation about that. But let's just say that if I were to say so that, that just on average is, you know, just because of the fact that uh, you were able to get to progress working, right? And uh, maybe that, like anybody says, to where... You know, to make the long story short, though, but, you know, really, like anybody say, is to where that um, whenever you first start working on something, though, uh, that uh, you would probably say is to where that, uh, you know, you first start working on something, it was not brand new out of the package, so that was the problem. It was not brand new out of the package, and like everybody else might say, is to where that the reason why the technician, you know, came in contact with you was because of the fact that because you know, the item you know it was not brand new it was not brand new out of the package it was not brand new out of the package whenever you received it you know, it was broke Yeah, it, it, it was broken. Yeah, defective. So in a lot of ways, I just really think too is to where that when we think about that and at 102 is where that, yeah, well really, that uh, what is so special about that? What is so magical about that? Well, really, it, uh, whenever it comes to uh, fixing things and whenever it comes to... Uh, you know, repairing things and maybe studying things, and uh, you're likely thinking as toward it. Yeah, well, really, that uh, that whenever it comes to uh, understanding about engineering and whenever it comes to mechanical work, right? And you were to where that um, this note, well, like uh, people may say, is toward it. Yeah, no, use notepad right there, but you know, still that. Um, Whenever we do the typical studies, though, and understanding about, you know, whenever it comes to failures, though, and whenever it comes to understanding about the better, uh, you know, restore the equipment and better understand the equipment and everything. And uh, you want to know, too, as to where that uh, do you think it's best to maybe write down on notes as to where that, uh, yeah, you besides the, the disability, but, uh, also right here, like somewhere like on the bottom right here is as to where what risk, you know, talk about what, what, uh, what is the risk when, um, it, uh, comes, um, to usage. So, uh, yeah, well, what is the risk whenever it comes to usage? And like everybody else might even say, too, that, you know, if you don't use it properly, then for, for sure there's going to possibly be a failure and uh, knowing about if it was uh, abused or maybe that, you know, if it wasn't, you know, used. I'm like, yeah, if it was, uh, 
you know, you know used or abused or anything like that, and, you know, but but still that uh, you know, you know, you weren't no two to talk about the technical maintenance and all that, but you know, really that uh, when uh, we do speak about uh, the usage rate and all that, you know, one oh two is you know, like yeah, do you have any idea of my um, so so yeah. So it sure seems that way that uh, when uh, we speak about notes and everything, no, and uh, 102 is to where that uh, speaking about technical failures a lot of times. And uh, 102 is to where that, uh, that, yeah, well, a lot of your knowledge that you, know, that you actually developed you know, over time, you know, like people might say, is to where, the, yeah, while you were sleeping, that there were some uh, updates that came in, you know, like, yeah, that were restored. And, uh, but it sure seems that way that, uh, that, you know, how often are most engineers and most professionals are maybe going to say is to where that, you know, you didn't go to school to do all this stuff. You didn't go to school. You did not even go to training, you know, school just to learn all these skills for what you see as of today, right? So that's why it sure seems that way that uh, what is the most important task uh, whenever it comes to uh, doing a job, and it sure seems that way that that's going to be a question to where a lot of career centers will maybe ask their tenants about as to where that, uh, you know, what's one thing that we do have, you know, for our company that uh, that we maybe that we would not have, uh, maybe if we would not have, you know, that though our, you know, our professionals and uh, those who have at least uh, so many years of experience, but then those who did come to us with the, the proper knowledge. The things that you learned at your own time that you were able to teach our company. So that's why it sure seems that way that we should really, like any company, should keep that in mind, by the way. About the fact about the things that you learned at your own time that you were able to share with the company. And uh, so that's why it sure seems that way that, uh, you know, whenever you do apply for a job, that, that maybe that that's one of the reasons why that maybe everybody seems to be mad all the time and maybe uh, be on higher demand all the time is because of the fact that, uh, that you know, yeah, if they do like what they see, for sure, that they're going to ask you to go ahead and, you know, yeah, please um, send us your information today and uh, we would like to go ahead and get you in for some training and ask you to work on a project of some sort. But on the other hand, too, it sure seems that way that when we speak about, you know, a disability, though, and like, say, what is so special about that, you know, the, the training, the gift of kindness, and, uh, so every time I think about special, though, special attention or something like that, I'm going to be thinking about a lot of times about, you know, yeah, you know, special uh, edition, uh, you know, DVD or something like that, or like everybody else might say, too, is to where special edition is supposed to be, uh, another way of saying is to where that, you know, not so hard, and uh, and that's basically what it is. Is like you're not so difficult. It's not. It's supposed to be not so hard. It's supposed to be easy. I mean, it's supposed to be easy. You know, don't me, don't be so hard on the person. You know, don't be so hard on him. Okay, you'll go easy on him. And um. So it sure seems that way. That yeah. Well, really, that uh, if not easy, then it's gonna be you know yeah optional. And um. So like anybody say, yeah, it's you know it's optional. So it's like you know people may say too that uh, according to uh, most disability um, papers would say too is to where that um, you know really that um, it's not uh, yeah it's not um, required necessarily, but it's, it's optional to where that uh, you know yeah. Anybody who's going to have a disability, and like everybody else would say too, is to word it, uh, you know, doctors would say too, is that, you know, yeah, go easy on the person, okay? You know, just if something, if something is required, and then yeah, you know, so like uh, everybody else would say too, is that um, they talk about for optional, but let's just say that, uh, you know, uh, when uh, we speak about requirements though, When uh, we do uh, speak about requirements, um, that what's the best way of how to uh, describe that? When it, whenever it comes to requirements, right? <laughs> you want to know too that okay, yeah, requirements. When uh, we do um, 
When we speak about requirements, though, that, that it's another way of saying is toward it. Yeah, well, really, that, uh, that you know, when we talk about requirements, it's another way of saying is toward that uh, these are the, the tasks that are, you know, needing, that are on higher demand, right? And uh, so that's why it sure seems that way that uh, the requirements would be about, like, the list to go by, about right down here, you know, right down here, they would be like, yeah, well, you have to, like, go by your 10 objectives right here, and you'll need to, you know, you need to uh, go by, you know, these um, expectations, and then, uh, you know, for what is highly expected, you know, for the job, and then, you know, this, and then and that, and so it sure seems that way that, um, that each time we might think about a disability, though, that, that that's another way of saying is toward a yeah, you know, for, you know, I have difficulties reading and writing or whatever, and for what is uh, so special and for the special treat of kindness, right? And uh, so it sure seems that way that uh, the first thing, and I can be honest with everybody here, too, that... Um, that you may think is toward that you know, you think about maybe two objectives are uh, the all the all the ten of those and a one oh two is toward uh, if all you really have to do is do these right here maybe two of those on at the very bottom right but then let's just say that maybe if it's um if it's maybe you know maybe eight or maybe ten days later and find out that, that, that that's that's still not all that needs to be done. You know, this person is now, they're asking you to go ahead and do this task or do this and do that. And so that's why it sure seems that way that, uh, that you're like, hey, go easy on the person, why don't you? You know, you they've already done at least uh, four tasks and you know, they've worked you know, for five hours total. And so that's why it sure seems that way. That every time we think about that is to where that um, that whenever we I'm like yeah looking at the applications and also looking at the, about the higher demands and then looking at the fact about that um, whenever it comes to disability and all that and you were to where that you know whenever you first started working on a job that uh, you might say is to where that I've learned a lot you know from. Or like, yeah, even over the weekend that I've learned a lot, right? And uh, that's why it sure seems that way that uh, that uh, whenever you first start working on a task, though, that uh, you, um, a lot of people would say is to where, yeah, well, really, that uh, whenever you first start working, that, that there was only so much that you knew and uh, there was only so much progress that was being made. And uh, so each time, if we would actually do the math, though, and... One thing that I did want to do, like doing like a configuration right here, talk about, you know, for three weeks, you know, three weeks right here, three weeks, if you were to multiply that times, yeah, multiply that times five or something like that, five hours or something like that. And so if we were like, yeah, do like a configuration like that, you know, for, you know, how did you do that? And like, you know, for three weeks times five hours right there. And uh, the way we think about that, though, if you were to put that into, like, a math equation or something like that, and a U102 is to where, that, yeah, disability pretty much means to give you more time, right? But let's just say on average is to where that, uh, well, really, that uh, if you are able to accomplish at least maybe five of those objectives within the three weeks and maybe five hours timing, but, like, let, let's just say that on average, though, that... Uh, that, yeah, within the five hours um, timing, or, you know, yeah. I, I mentioned before about 12 hours timing, but but if I were, if you were to put that into like an, like a, into like an equation or something like that, you know, the, the math facts right there, and your 102 is toward that, you know, three weeks and five hours, and you like to say no, uh, but, um, yeah, you know, so if you were to do like a math fact right here, like, no, we're not going to give you three weeks to do work on this, but we're going to give you five days. We're going to give you five days times five hours. So, like, let's just say if you were to put that into an equation, and, uh, you know, you probably think in twos toward it, we're really, <laughs> that, um, you know, um, 
that's a little bit just too much, you know, for more than what I can handle, right? So a lot of times it seems like it's all about testing your knowledge. And like everybody else might even say too, uh, that really, that, uh, you know, does it really, you know, help a, a lot whenever you're able to at least write down some ideas, generate some ideas. And like, let's just say if it's, uh, you know, maybe, you know, yeah, 12 hours, <laughs> 12, I'm like, yeah, 12 hours time, multiply that times, multiply that times 12 days. You know, how much are you able to get done within 12 hours and in 12 days? So if we, if you were to actually do that, like an experiment right here in the 102 is to where that, is that more or is that less? <laughs> in a way, in a way we think about that though, is like, Talking about is that more or is that less? So it sure seems that way that people may say is toward it. Is that really considered professional right there? The way we think about that. I'm like, yeah, the things that we do on an everyday basis and that you want to know too is toward it. You want to kind of put that into an equation, right? Is toward it. Do you believe that you've done more or you have done less within it, you know, your seven days that you're know, timing toward it, you know, from what you originally agreed to do and then compared to uh, what was already done for you or maybe something like, you know, okay, that right there, you know, it was already there. You know, what, what you know, yeah, an automatic step forward. So, so it sure seems that way that, yeah, it, it, all the experts would even say too is toward it, uh, that, you know, that that's, uh, that's really the beauty of it, everybody. You know, that's the beauty of it. Is that if it's done for you automatically, you know for sure that that's what the experts are really asking for. Is that, uh, you know, I'm, well, I'm sorry that we think, seem to be, that we're overworking, you know, the, the work and the progress. And I'm sorry you may think that, um, that we're just putting a little bit too much work and task, you know, on, on the agendas. But, on your hand, too, that we have learned a lot, you know, from the work that you do. And uh, like everybody else would say, too, that, yeah, well, disability, you know, disability is supposed to give you more time. But, like, let's just say on average, though, that um, this person, uh, like me, would maybe say is to where if you learned a lot of these skills at your own time, you know, you done studying and you took, you spent three hours of your spare time to put this together, so at least give you some credit for that instead of they say is to where, well, really, that's not done right, or this is not done right, or that that wasn't done on time. But I just really think 102 is to where that those experts and those engineers will maybe even say too is to where that why don't you give those experts and those engineers credit, you know, just by saying is to where that those who do... Uh, have gained a lot of knowledge just by their study time to where at their own time you know, at their own time this is the these are the, the results and this is the equation that they were able to come up with during the time while they were studying you know compared to the fact about okay yeah well really whenever you first start working on a project you actually you know, came to us part-time right for that reason and that you said on that letter is to where the yeah well due to my disability that I can only handle so much but they might say is to her, well, we apologize, you know, we apologize, but, you know, we're not trying to uh, make it difficult, but we're just trying to get a better understanding about what, uh, what analysis that we be able to come up with right here. So that's another reason why that, um, it sure seems that way that, uh, it's like, yeah, whenever you do, uh, read messages and notes and all that, and just want to know too, is to where anything that you're trying to generate and, they like say, if you were to actually put that into a math equation, though, and uh, 102 is to where that, you know, really, that, uh, you know, should you just really just go a little bit more easier on the person, knowing about how much hard work, you know, that the person, that they put into something. And uh, that's why it sure seems that way that, uh, you know, really, that all those recordings and all the information that's all generated right there, <laughs> and that you 102 is to where... That the things that you're able to render and define, you know, even on the calculator, but then now with with our computers and, you know, computers and other devices and 102 is to where that, yeah, we're really, the truth of the really, the fact of the matter is knowing that people would really, would like to see 
those results, you know, what you were able to come up with before they actually decide about, okay, yeah, okay, I get the idea. So it, it sure seems that way, yeah. That's what it's about, everybody. You know, yeah. I know what you mean. I know what you mean. You know, yeah, I get the idea. I get the idea. So it sure, it sure so it sure seems that way that uh whenever we do whenever we take down notes a lot of times and it's like, yeah, I get the idea. Oh yeah, I, I get the idea now. Or, you know, yeah. So you start talking about something and it's like somebody's gonna maybe say, I have no clue what you're talking about until you actually show them, you know, a few of results and a few examples and they're like, Oh, okay, yeah, I, 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 I get the idea. I get the idea now. <laughs> but anyway, um, it says some good advice there, but but still, the top top up for disability though, and one o two is that yeah, you know, whenever it comes to disability and they say whenever it comes to uh, time completing a large task and multitask and also understanding the knowledge, but people may say is toward it that uh, you know not so difficult, you know not so difficult on the person, but give them credit, you know right, but on your hand too, it sure seems that way that uh, you know. <laughs> Whenever you start taking down notes for something, and it sure seems that way, this, um, I guess it's an overview, if you want to kind of call it like a little bit like an overview. It's a little bit of an overview of uh, tasks and objectives, you know, all put together onto one document and uh, talk about for PDF files, especially PDFs, and also uh, if we're talking about PowerPoint files, that um, your 102 is that... Uh, <laughs> Yeah, that uh, all this stuff, all this data that you collected, uh, you know, from maybe from the, the five hours while you were working and you want to know too is to work <laughs> that, yeah, that, um, you know, are you really able to see and realize uh, the big picture about what's been going on, you know, with uh, the database and all that? But on the other hand, it sure seems that way that uh, when we do speak about disability, though, and people may say it's too worthy, yeah, well, you know, hey, you know, go easy on it, you know, but, you know, still. But the way I think about it, like, uh, you know, when we speak about, um, you know, um, working the math, though, and uh, you want to know, too, is to worth it, uh, you know, if you want to kind of generate that into, like, a math problem, really, but, uh, but it's like, you're really, that, um, Whenever you first start working on something, it sure seems that way that, you know, yeah, you know, you, uh, on your hand, that um, you start working on something and you may seem like, well, really, it seems to be a lot simpler than compared to what you originally thought it was. But like everybody else would say, too, that, uh, you know, really, it wasn't so simple, but on your hand that you you learned a lot, you know, while you were studying about that. You know, but so it sure seems that way. Well, yeah, this right here is like a just like a little overview right here of uh, of the information right here, based on what you were actually were trying to calculate. You know, based on the fact about you know, yeah, you want to go and take down notes of anything that you want to learn about, especially. <laughs> But it sure seems that way, like people would say that when we speak about technical failures and all that, and uh, 102 is to where, um, they, yeah, do you want to go and highlight that and just say, is there anything that you've been able to find out? And uh, 102, the, yeah, well, to talk about, you know, for any of the big problems and these special kits or anything like that. But anyway, um, but they talk about for the updates, uh, you know, ready to install and all, but so yeah, you know. <laughs> So each time we think about that, and uh, you want to know too, just to get a better understanding about, you know, yeah, you know, really, go easy on them, but, um, but it sure seems like, yeah, well, really, what is another way of how you want to call it, you know, with, you know special uh, attention, especially, or this spe special uh, treatment and, uh, you know, anything special, really, but, uh, but half the time, you want to know too, is to where if you want to kind of put that into a perspective, is to where, that, yeah, well, really, that, uh, you know, to show a little bit more support and kindness and to know and advise us toward it. Yeah, whenever you first start working a job, though, that uh, you see uh, a lot more things and maybe uh, a few uh, of the other clients uh, that they can't see. And 
you want to know too is to where that that's the whole you know that's really the beauty of it is to where the things that you can see that only you can see that maybe a few of the clients cannot see and that's why it sure seems that way to where that yeah well really you know what does that usually mean whenever you can only whenever you can see a few things that maybe a few of the clients and other workers cannot see and uh, that's why it sure seems that way that, uh, you know, yeah, well, really, you know, isn't that the whole part about being on a higher demand and maybe a little bit of the reason why that, uh, you know, those, um, you know, managers are asking you to where that, uh, you know, to coordinate with them and all of it. So, but on your hand, it sure seems that way that, uh, you know, yeah, that whenever you put together something generates some ideas though and a lot of times it's like yeah well really that uh you know whenever you put it together yourself then that's another reason why all the other experts would say too is to where the yeah well if you just made it up for sure or if anything that it has not been confirmed yet or if it you know yeah it hasn't been approved yet but um but until it does and you you know for sure people may say the yeah well really it seems like it's all about the fact about, you know, yeah, well, really, you know, people are able to, yeah, they'll, they'll go ahead and you know, they'll, they'll listen to you and for more effect is to where, yeah, you know, really, if it works or if anything, you know, if people would say is to where, yep, yeah, well, I know what you mean by that. But anyway, uh, thanks for watching, everyone, and have a great day.